Hi, I'm Mark Keefe with the NRA Publications, and I am fortunate to be at NRA headquarters with an old and dear friend of mine, Jason Hornady. Now, Jason, I got to tell you, from everything that I've seen, the ammo business is being pretty good to you guys right now. <laughs> well, you know, we're just a small family business trying to get by out there, Mark, and we spend a lot of time trying to do neat and cool stuff and and seems to be well received by our, our shooting customer. So, you know, when I first started dealing with Hornady, it was just a, a bullet company. Yep. Sometimes you did ammo. Yep. But now, I mean, Hornady uh, is in the security products business. Of course, it's in the bullet business, you know, for other manufacturers and yourself. Mm -hmm. You're in the ammunition business. And really, the thing that I love about Hornady is cartridge development. So, I mean, the 6.5 Creedmoor was the overnight success that took 10 years. <laughs> That's right. Everybody thinks uh, it was overnight. But, you know, what's going on with ARC these days? You know, you're right. We still think of ourselves as a bullet company. Um, bullet makes the cartridge, the, the whole deal. But the 6.5 Creedmoor kind of started a whole trend of get that bullet out there. It doesn't always have to just be fast. Let's go efficient. And then you start looking at different platforms and everybody's got an AR-15 these days, right? Right. And you you want to try and maximize. We hear all kinds of things about how we need to do something better than a 223 or a 556. And so a couple years ago, we started working on something with a little heavier, a little longer range platform. We came up with the six arc. So now we're, we've got a 100 grain bullet in there going relatively fast. And you know, gives you some great downrange performance. Instead, instead of it being a a 5.56, five, it's a zero to 400 yard gun. Now we're in that six, 700 yards. Maybe if you're a better shot than me and better trigger control, eh, maybe a little further, but trying to do it more efficient, a little heavier weight. And we're learning that long sleek bullets do some cool stuff. Yeah, so and that's really kind of the revolution in bullets as far as I can see. You you, you know, you guys are offering just, you know, bullets in, in regular loaded cartridges that have BCs that I didn't even think were possible. Right. And, you know, we learned doing a bunch of different stuff and and the long story that we probably don't have time for, but started messing with Doppler radar and you right. see what starts happening with bullets for real and, and start talking about drag curves, which instead of it being a, a ballistic coefficient, which is a math number that's estimating things now, we're, we can tell you exactly what's going to happen. Right. And right. once you started learning that, then you started changing the way you're making tips and you started changing the bow tails and it, it's just opened up a whole new world of stuff that makes shooting fun. I mean, it's fun to shoot stuff, groups that size and, right. you know, at longer distances than we ever thought. Well, and you get to see your impacts and, you know, mm -hmm. and you have flatter shooting cartridges. So, yeah, I mean, that, as far as I can tell, has been one of the, the driving principles of Hornady. If it's not fun, you guys probably aren't going to do it. If it's not fun, then why do it? it yeah. That's what we sell. We sell fun. And I, I tell you, we got a great group of kids. I, I hate to call them kids because you and I were kids when we right. met each other the right. first time. That we just let them run and go build cool stuff. And, and they come in and, hey, do you think this is cool? And, yeah, I kind of do. And sometimes you don't tell them you think it's cool no, no, because no. you can't let them. No, no, no. no. But, uh, um, and sometimes, you know what? Not everything's, yeah, you go shoot some more. But, well, you know, the, the difference that I see with Hornady and a lot of the uh, other major companies is, you know, they basically have to sell one or two guys. You know, you don't have to go to, you know, five different layers of bureaucracy. If somebody named Hornady says, yeah, we're going to do that, it, it happens. That's going to, it's, we're very flat and it's, it's a fortunate thing, you know, and maybe it's our, just our Midwestern upbringing. It's not that hard. If it makes sense, we're going to do it. And we don't have to spend a whole lot of time doing budgets and we're not publicly traded and don't have right. to, you know, I'm pretty sure we're walking HR nightmares, but, <laughs> but you know, <laughs> it, it, it seems to be working. It is. So anyhow, for more on Hornady, go to Hornady.com. And for more here at NRA Publications, go to AmericanRifleman.org. Thanks, Jason. Thank you.